glasses on. Yeah, it's all about the attitude. And guys, we are in Tunnel Hill. Mark's finishing up in the shower. I just finished taking my shower. Truck's in the shop and Boone's in the kennel out there. I would say Boone is the least happiest one of all. He was uh, doing a little yelping and crying when I left him in there, but I'm getting ready to go get the guy out. No big deal on the truck. There's just a, a bracket that, and the cable that was holding the air tank had broke a couple of weeks ago, and I've got a um, couple of bungees holding it up. But while we're sitting here, I thought I'd just go ahead and get that fixed. And we're waiting for our pre-assignment to come in to figure out where we're going to get rolling for tomorrow. Hey, we're in Tunnel Hill, and look who's here, guys. Jay That's, Norton. Yes, sir. It's still a, a little reunion, reunion here. here. Well, actually, it's not a reunion. This is the first time Jay and I have met face-to-face, -face, even though we have talked many times and chatted back and forth. How's uh, everything going for you, Jay? Oh, it's going great, man. I've been running my butt off. That's why we're here. Hey, hey people. As you can see, we're not in Big Red right now. We're going on a bit of adventure. Right now. Walking Berlin. All right, we're on top of the mountain, guys, here in Rock City, Georgia. Are you guys ready for a little adventure that's a little different than the adventure you normally see here on the trucking journey? It starts here. Nice. No, you want to kind of like this is the Grand Corridor. Hey, there's a mouse. There's a mouse. Or a mole or something. It's a mole. Hey, you little mole. That's a mole. Get that sign. Let no one say and say it to your You're saying that all was beauty here until you came. You just think two kids come across here. Come on, we'll show you the rest. If I keep trucking another year or two, I may not be able to make it through here. There's a needle eye from up above. Goblin's underpants. Temperature just dropped by like 10, 15 degrees under here. Mm -hmm. Feels great. Mm -hmm. Notice how the tree grows with the sun. Mark, you say this is better than taking an extended nap in Big Red today? Uh, yeah. I mean, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, make your help. Decisions, decisions. Guess we're gonna swing along. You can feel it swing it too. <laughs> okay, so that's the stone bridge. Oh, cool. 
That's where two people fell to their death at, right there, in that corner. I think he can. Yeah, he's got a little Actually, back in uh, Abbeville, we've got a barn that has a Sea Rock City painted on it. Oh, yeah? <laughs> People, here's what all the hype has been for 85 years to see seven states standing in one spot. There's North Carolina, South Carolina, Georgia, and over here is Bama. Roll Tide. So you got Tennessee right here. You got Kentucky and Virginia. North Carolina. South Carolina. Georgia. And then Alabama that one. Do you see seven states? Yeah, for these people, you may just want to put the video on pause to read this. Having fun so far? What a view. I don't see the penny. South Carolina. was the first used by Colonel William Moultrie in the Revolutionary War. Again, four years later. Living on the edge. Could you imagine people living right there? There it is. Yeah, and we left Boone back in the truck. We could have brought him. I'll show him the video. Hey, is that a turtle? Looks just like a turtle. Yeah. No, that's tortoise shell rock. I brought us up here. What was up until your last one out? So if you stayed here till nine o'clock at night. They won't lock up until you last one up. Hmm. Hey, wait, come back here when we put all the Christmas lights up this time. Uh... Oh, you're starting. Y'all might have to call a tow truck for me. Call a tow truck for me? That's what I was saying. When you get down, to the truck, get down towards the bottom, you actually have to walk sideways and then you gotta tuck back like this just to get through there. <laughs> that ain't well rubbed. Okay, this is gear. Oh, you can actually see the gear over there. And here's the story of lovers of these people. You may want to pause it to read. Your head be sticking the ground like a hot
Yeah, see, it's just balanced. It's balanced there, balanced with one, two, one, two, one. This. Anyway, they make a jet. A jet for you to do Well, no, what? Feel the wind how cool it is? I do feel the wind. Because we are standing in front of the cave of the wind. Wow, what a place. We are in the Enchanted Cave here in Rock City, Georgia. If you hadn't ever been before, put it on your list, guys. This is cool. Stace, you would absolutely love this spot right here. Look, all of this is amethyst crystal quartz. And some of it is even gold. And I hear there's gold in these star hills. All of this. You're about to enter Fairyland Caverns, a unique part of Rock City. Look at that. It's diamond. Chris, look at that. That's quartz or stuff. I mean, that's. Look at that big one back there. Look at that in the corner. That was a quarry. Wow. I would think this is gold here. Yeah. I'm a mountain for a long period of time. Is all this natural here, or they glue it to the wall to make this? Oh, that's not showing it. It's all stolen. We are still going through this cave. I think we're somewhere like a thousand feet under the top of the cave. I mean, under the top of the mountain. And ooh, here comes too dark. Yeah, it is. For me to show you guys, but all of these walls over here, like the entire wall, is all quartz and crystal. It's beautiful. You really just feel the energy in here. Little red riding jacket being installed. Goldilocks. And the big red nails. Now, let me get tell you. She had so many kids, she didn't know what to do. Right, well that was fairy tale land and mother goose land. Now we're back out in the sunshine. I tell you guys, it's gonna be hard to condense this video down to 14, 15 minutes. Keep on turning, Mary, keep on burning. Oh, we're at the bar where they have free wine tasting. So I think I'm getting ready to try some blackberry wine here at Rock City, Georgia.
Well, I guess that's the end, but what a great ending with some wine tasting. I had the blackberry and the Chattanooga blush and Rock City Red. Very, very good wine. And they even have wine slushies here. I know when I bring Stacy up here, there's no way I'm getting out without some wine slushies and a, a bottle of Tour wine. That was Rock City. What'd you think about it, Mark? It's amazing. It's beautiful. It really was. For all you that haven't been yet, put it on your list. Come on down to Rock City. It's like uh, 20 bucks and some change to get in here. Well worth it. We've probably been here, what, two hours? All right, as I got to walking through, I was just craving some contact with the earth. So I took my shoes off. So I've been barefooted through that, but now I'm getting ready to go into the bathroom. Time to put shoes on. Back there in fairy tale land, you may have saw three blind mice. But right here is three hungry guys. So we're gonna go grab some lunch. I pity the fool that orders dominoes. I had Mr. T's last uh, night. We are in downtown Chattanooga. We got the aquarium over here and something called the block back here. But we're going, look, looking at the Genghis Grill, build your own stir fry or cheeseburger, cheeseburger. Choices, choices. Ghost tour. They got sriracha on every table. Genghis Khan, you pick your meat, you pick your seasoning, you put it in a bowl. You pick your vegetables, and then they're going to cook it up for us. Vegetables, even celery and peppers, and there's cilantro, and spinach, and garlic water, sauces to put in here. It's the before, and it's the one that. I'm excited. I'm sitting here, waiting on my bowl. All right. If you're ever in Chattanooga, you gotta go to Kangas Grill. It's the build your own bowl. Every bite of like a different flavor is absolutely delicious. So freaking full. And I still got a to-go box. We're gonna go for a little walk and check the river out before we uh, get back to the, the excursion, head back to the terminal. Cause I, I've got a funny feeling once we get back to the terminal, Jim's taking a nap. two aquariums there right at the banks of the Tennessee River. We've got the freshwater aquarium and then the saltwater aquarium. These days people all take you on the ocean journey. You got to go on the Rock City journey because normally it's the trucking journey. Ain't that right, Marco? Yes, sir. All right, well, that's going to be a wrap, guys, on episode 62. Hope you enjoyed our adventure to Rock City. I know we did, and I know what's everyone saying. What happened to Boone? Did you leave him in the kettle? No. Here's Boone. And um, I guess we'll see you guys uh, next episode. Thanks for tuning in. Please feel free to share. Sorry this one was a little longer than usual, but there was just so much beauty at Rock City. I just couldn't take any more out than I already did. See you next time.